What is up, Troubler Nation? I'm your host, Keller Keemstar. Let's go right into the news. Our first story is coming from Jake Paul. Way back in the day on MTV, there was a show called Fantasy Factory. And one of the main characters was, well, Drama. And Drama went on to start his own clothing line known as Young and the Reckless. And yesterday, Drama posted on Instagram, Damn, Jake Paul, I thought we were Ohio brothers. Showing a design of one of his hoodies and then showing one of Jake Paul's. Again, Young and the Reckless, Jake Paul's. He fucking stole it! Adam from No Jumper tweeted this out. Jake Paul is at it again, showing that even the back of the hoodie was copied. Now this dude is just stealing other people's designs? Like, what the fuck, Jake? Also in the news. Now this is everywhere. You guys already know about this. PewDiePie said the N-word. Well, yesterday, he made an apology. And actually, I thought it was like a perfect apology. He was like... There, there's no reason for, for me to do this. Like, I, there's no excuses. I'm sorry. However, the next day he was streaming PUBG and he almost made the same mistake again. Roll it. Thank you very much. Hey, hey, hey. Okay. Man. Oh my God. Man. Oh, hello. Okay, okay, okay. I have it. It worked. Great. <sighs> Took one day for me to almost slip up. Fantastic. Good job. Good job, Felix. I don't even want to say the the censor version. I'm like fucking. God damn it. <laughs> Hillary Clinton. It's not even funny. I'm just laughing. Another YouTuber was talking about the PewDiePie N-word controversy known as H3H3. In fact, he did a whole podcast on it. Tweeting out, H3H3 podcast going live. Let's talk about PewDiePie and the N-word. Showing a picture of iDubbbz, who says the N-word, and Tana Mojo, who says the N-word, with PewDiePie's face over Tana, who has said the N-word. And this story is being reported by Keemstar. I... I... Fuck you, Alex! Anyhow, H3H3 uploaded this podcast to YouTube and it has over 13,000 dislikes! I have never seen H3H3 or Ethan get this much hate. People are furious with him because he 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 went hard at PewDiePie saying, well, well, this is what he said. Roll it. I don't think Felix is a racist person. But God damn, he really kind of just was really comfortable using that word. Like you're reaching for all these words, right? And you're like, oh, let me just like a little <laughs> and bum for you. <laughs> I mean, I know this is a point a lot of people say, but it certainly seems like that's not the first time he's used that word in that context. Yeah, man, he really just dropped the end bomb like straight up. And the way he used it was just awful. Now, the reason why people are so mad is because they think that Ethan, H3H3, is being a hypocrite because on his podcast, he said the N-word too. A video was uploaded titled H3H3's Hypocrisy Over PewDiePie Saying the N-Word, where it shows clips of H3H3 complaining about PewDiePie, and then it shows clips of H3H3 saying the N-Word when he had iDubs on there. Roll it. I don't think Felix is a racist person. But, god damn, he really kind of just was really comfortable using that word. <laughs> Nigger fucking whore. <laughs> it's a wonderful, it's just a wonderful string of words that really gets you going. That really just kind of, <laughs> fuck you, <laughs> you're fat. <Yeah. laughs> like you're reaching for all these words, right? And you're like, oh, let me just like a little <laughs> and bum for you. <laughs> I mean, I know this is a point a lot of people say, but it certainly seems like that's not the first time he's used that word in that context. And look, if you joke around with your friends privately, we've all, you said, we say offensive things privately when we're joking with our friends because we all find it funny for one reason or another. But goddamn, dog, you're fucking, you're freaking live streaming. I love that I can just say <laughs> you're fat it, though. Yeah. Like, I feel like you're, you're using a little liberally. I love <laughs> saying <laughs> you're fat it. It's so wonderful. Yeah. So now you're going to get shit for it. Oh, my God. 
Andy Milanakis responded to PewDiePie saying the N-word by tweeting out this. I'm about to pull up on PewDiePie showing a picture of him with some rappers drinking some cough medicine with some Sprite, aka Lean. Also in the news, on the last drum alert, we talked about KSI and the Joe Weller fight. We talked about them being at Upload and them beefing and them throwing each other. And we also talked about KSI making fun of Joe Weller's depression. Well, KSI uploaded a video titled Responding to the Joe Weller Fight where he apologized for making fun of depression. In the video, KSI said he, he was talking about Joe and didn't mean to offend anyone else. So... There you have it. However, KSI's brother, Comedy Shorts Gamer, he showed the video of the Joe Weller and KSI fight to his mother, KSI's mom, and this is what she said about Joe Weller. Roll it. What's your opinion on that? This guy used to be JJ's fan, isn't he? Used to be, yeah, 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 he used to be JJ's fan. There, his, um, the, his breakthrough on YouTube, his video was how to be KSI. Yeah, I mean, if you're gonna have a fight, oh, oh okay, have a fight, but why? This beef is obviously real, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, This guy is so, he's, he's an ungrateful guy, honestly. Ungrateful, yeah. Because this guy, JJ has taken him on holidays, not once, not twice, and he paid for his accommodation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And look at the way now, look at the way he's now treating JJ. Yeah, he took him to uh, Greece. Greece and um, New York. He's, he's taking him to three holidays and he treats JJ like this. So no, 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 no. But you, you know need what? to understand, to why did show. the beef start? Joe Weller, for no reason, just started having a dig at JJ. But, but why? But why? What for? Exactly. Oh, I, I, yeah, I, I, no, why, that's why, the thing. Why, no, no, that's why? the thing. That's the thing. There's, that's ab what I don't there's absolutely no reason why. There is absolutely no reason. He just did it. And he also had a dig at me as well. I know, look, look, look at Joe Weller. He needs three people with him. The, you mean the goons? Yeah. Damn, calling Joe Weller ungrateful. Ungrateful. Damn. Also in the news, that prankster known as Vitaly a couple days ago had guns drawn on him by the police. Now, it turns out he didn't get arrested, but shit got scary for a moment. Roll it. <laughs> Holy fuck. Oh my god. Oh my god. Now I have no idea if that was 100% real or why the cops even pulled guns on it. I have no idea. I should have DM Vitaly, but I, I've been pretty lazy. I'm sorry. You know what? I'm going to DM him right now and ask him. My fucking camera battery's... I don't have to... I'll, I'll get you an answer tomorrow. My fucking camera battery's gonna die. And now for a final story. Yes, I'm talking super fast. Uh, apparently a streamer was trying to open up a bottle and this is what happened. Roll it. There's gotta be a game where like you everyone slowly loosens the the cap, the little cork here, and then puts it right up to their eye. You know? It's like Russian roulette, but with, with the bottle. Ah! Oh! oh my god! Oh <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, this shit's blinking around. My camera's gonna die. Guys, thank you so much if you enjoyed this video. Make sure you slap a like on it. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe with notifications on. And uh, Drama Alert Nation, now over 2,900,000 subscribers. Bye. My new mobile game. My new mobile game. My new mobile game. My new You're like, what is Team Star on about? My new mobile game, my new.